What's up, guys? I'm coming to you with yet another episode of Risky Cooking. Um, in today's episode, I thought we would do something that was a little bit simpler, um, a little bit, you know, a, a meal, a dish that you can make even if you're not interested in spending a lot of time uh, cooking. If you just want something quick to eat, you know, a quick dinner that you can make if you're not really a cook. So what we're going to be making today is a basic bean burrito. Real simple, just, you know, something you can make a few of these for dinner. You can make one of them as a snack. Not a lot of mess, not a lot of fuss. Just a nice, simple meal to make. So, uh, first of all, sorry about the mess. I am defrosting uh, some cake. But what we're going to start with is a large flour tortilla for our burrito. Um, I've got these great value ones. And then... We also have some Mexican style cheese. And so obviously we're gonna put cheese in our bean burrito, but what I like to do is I like to get the cheese onto the tortilla and then microwave it a bit, just to get the cheese a little bit warmed up, a little bit melted. All right, so I've got the cheese sprinkled around my tortilla nice and evenly, it's not, it doesn't really matter, um, into the microwave and just let it go for a few seconds. All right, next up before, I'm teasing you guys a little bit, but before we get to the beans, the star of the show, we're gonna throw on a bit of sour cream and just a bit of uh, vegetable type greenery stuff. So let's see if I can do this while filming. All right, so it doesn't, you know, I just get these salad kits because they tend to have a nice mix of vegetables. So I'm not gonna use the, uh, oh, this one's probably going a little old, but it should be fine. All right, so now we've got, you know, a nice space. So we've got that little bit of preparation, and then here's here's the start. I've got some uh, Bush's Original Baked Beans. It's just this tiny little can. I thought it was real cute. Um, so yeah, on it goes. Oh, <laughs> they're not coming out too easy. Oh. And now I'm gonna throw maybe just a little bit more cheese on, just for fun. Um, yeah. And I'll, I'm gonna wrap this up, take it over to the desk, and we'll see how it tastes. All right, guys, I'm here at my desk, so I'm gonna do my best to get this burrito uh, sort of wrapped up into burrito form. And then, excuse me, we'll take a bite. I'm just gonna fold up the end a bit, and then fold over the sides. And all right, good enough. So I've got a lot of bread at the top, but I'll just sort of bite in from the side to make sure I get some of the uh, filling. Mmm. That is really good. The beans... The sweetness of the beans and sort of the sourness of the sour cream work really well together. And then there's that little bit of crunch from the vegetables we put in. Um, and of course the cheese makes the whole thing just have a richer flavor to it. The only, the only thing that's a little bit lacking is this, um, is this, uh, wheat or is this tortilla from Walmart, but that's okay. Um, the filling definitely makes up for the, uh, not the highest quality tortilla. So yeah, if you guys are looking for a quick snack, maybe a, maybe a meal, a quick dinner, this uh, Breen Burrito is definitely the way to go. See you next time.